It's Thursday, September 30th. I'm Mark Lasea, and it's time to get loaded. New rumors are surfacing about a second generation iPad. According to two Goldman Sachs analysts, it will be out in June of 2011 and come with a built-in camera, a mini USB port, and sport a thinner and lighter body compared to the previous model. They say the 9.7 inch screen will stay the same despite rumors of an 8 inch version coming out. And if you want a phone that runs Android or uses Google search and mobile apps, the company has a new site for you. Google.com slash phone is a database of all of Google's Android devices. Users sort products by release date, country, manufacturer, carrier, and where to buy. You can get your fix of Google phones by going to Google.com slash phone. Amazon announced a beta version of Kindle for the web. This doesn't require the company's e-reader software and users can look at samples and first chapters of a book right in the browser. You can share book samples with a friend through email, Facebook, and Twitter. If you want to keep reading after the sample, it will push users to buy the full-length e-books from Amazon's bookstore. Nintendo announced that the 3DS will hit Japan next year on February 26th, and North America and Europe will get it in March. Pricing for the DS in Japan is set at the equivalent of $300, which makes it the most expensive handheld the company has ever released. Even the PSP Go was priced at $249 when it first launched. There's no official price for the US version, but we can expect similar pricing. Those are all your headlines for today. I'm Mark Lasea for CNET.com, and you've just been loaded.